it's been like a roller coaster, you know, um, up and down, or depending on what's happening in Hong Kong, particularly. Uh, so in general terms, my job hasn't changed at all. It's just uh, the outside influences that make it sometimes more exciting than others. You go into these very steady periods and then something kicks off and then for months it's, it's this story that keeps repeating and repeating. The basic obvious one is Covid. Well it made a very nice change from protest cartoon. Suddenly that started to sort of um, dwindle and then suddenly Covid's here. This one's for Easter Sunday. The Easter Bunny obviously crosses a lot of borders to deliver all the Easter eggs, so I imagine him getting tested every time he crossed the border. Also linked to Covid, um, while well, everyone's struggling with loss of earnings and closures of businesses, um, the supermarkets have happily been um, hiking up their prices. recent one was um, National Security Education Day. Little kids are often scared of monsters under the bed, but um, after a day of national security education for, for young kids, I'd imagine they'd be scared of um, independence advocates and foreign forces hiding under the bed and forgot all about the monsters. Apart from the drawing style slightly different, the two old guys are the same. They're based on two old guys I knew in Hong Kong uh, a long time ago, Mr. Wong and Mr. Lee. The guy with the vest is based on the, the watchman at one of, one of my first um, office spaces here. Me and him used to go for dim sum. He didn't actually have a bird in a cage, but there would be birds in cages sometimes where, when we went out. I know. Mr. Lee was an old man that used to stop you either on Lama or sometimes in Central he'd recognise you to practice his English. I like to sort of try and get something in that's, that's got a bit of humour but makes people think, uh, either think I'm wrong or think I'm right, you know, or perhaps it resonates with them thinking they were, because you know when you think you, there's something bugging you about a situation and then when you see it in a picture you go, ah, yeah, like, you know, that's what I, my aim is actually, not, 